second ago, but your favorite scene that personally you were involved in, because there's so many and they're so funny. I'm just going to say mine for, for Ed and, uh, and Eric together, moon landing. Moon landing. <laughs> <laughs> I, thank God it wasn't a splashdown. Yeah. I was worried he was going to make me do oh, the splashdown. Oh, gosh. Yeah, splashdown. I, I love um, a buddy, my buddy who's actually visiting again from Kansas City, a guy I went to high school with and elementary with. He, he was visiting me that when we were shooting that. He flew in from Kansas City and it was like 9 o'clock on a Friday night. And he flew in, landed at LAX, got in the car, drove to 20th Century Fox to see. Me and Ed touching asses. <laughs> like, and I said, you know, work hard, believe in yourself, never give up on your dream, and you too yeah. can touch butts with a television yeah. icon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you. Is that the best you can do? Because it's going to take a little more than some lame trash talk to get me out of my... God, what the hell was that? Our butts pressed against each other. They didn't press, it was glancing. Stop talking about it. Oh, come on, all the time you've spent in the locker room, this can't be your first moon landing. You got a name for it? It's very common. You got off easy, at least it didn't happen after a shower. Enough. We call that a splashdown. That's it. <laughs> I liked, um, I did like, uh, Fizbo, I mean, which I think is Eric's favorite. I mean, Will we see more Fizbo? That whole um, sequence, yeah, I, mean, I, I bet, the whole sequence of the gas station where Eric's going <laughs> to... Now, you know what? This is an example of a story that actually happened to me. Yeah. At the gas cloud. station in Brentwood, a guy ran into my leg when I was standing by my, my car, <laughs> and we almost got into a fight. We didn't. Uh, it happened, and I told Steve about the story. The guy was an incredible idiot, who I actually think I know. We won't get into that one. <laughs> but he incorporated it into the show through that filter, and it turned into these guys' story with the Fizbo the Clown, which was genius. Wouldn't have been as funny uh, the other way. Forget about it, all right? Listen, Carrot Top, I didn't touch you. Oh, so do the smart funny. thing. Shut your hole, get in your car, or drive away. Is there a problem here? What the hell are you? I'm the ass-kicking clown that'll twist you like a balloon animal. I will beat your head against this bumper until the airbags deploy. So apologize to my boyfriend right now. Apologize? Boyfriend? Apologize! Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And as a result, the, the actor friend of mine told me the other day that every pilot breakdown they've seen this season so far has asked for a Julie Bowen type. No! Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 that's just embarrassing. You mean you mean they want they want her to be beautiful and hilarious and all American and and pregnant? <laughs> Julie, what? I was not, 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 now, not, not now. Not now. I was nine months pregnant with twins in the pilot, so that was from hell. Yeah. <laughs> we had to cut, we hit it in every possible way we could. Uh, <laughs> Laundry baskets. And children. Chil we Putting a lot of children. Luke was exactly the right height. Just walked around with him everywhere. Come on, Luke. Cakes, bowls. Yeah. But, but, I, I, but, I, but, but to talk about Sophia for a second, you know, obviously she's beautiful, and, uh, and that's a given, and she's Latin. And we know that. <laughs> but, but she's very good, a uh, very good comedian. And um, uh, the scene, I think the show when her first husband, you know, Benjamin Brad, comes back. Yeah. And uh, when she was angry at me for keeping Manny up all night. And she was going a little crazy and losing. And I thought that was so wonderful. And, uh, and uh, I entertain you. You do. <laughs> go, Jay. Yeah, go. Yes, go, Jay. And take Manny with you, too. Okay. No, Manuel Alberto in the car or I put you in the trunk. Jay, I'm not going to argue anymore. I'm not going to say anything else. Do whatever you want. But I don't want to hear you anymore saying that Colombians are crazy. Because you're the one that is acting crazy. Even though he's the one that is making you act crazy. So I know what the hell I'm talking about. Money! <laughs> yes, and there was a, a thing that Julie did when, 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 when I flew the plane into Ty's face. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and, and this is, this is uh, in the vein of, of uh, improv. 
we were it was at the end of the episode and now I, I decide that I'm going to I'm going to apologize to Phil and I go around the couch he's lying there with ice and I you if you saw it and then I apologize sort of <laughs> the best way that I could and when I do that and it's sort of the show is kind of winding down Julie came behind me and kissed me on the top of the head and said thanks dad it was very sweet and it was completely ad lib I mean I didn't expect it and I, those kinds of moments I think are really uh, special <laughs> oh. Uh, oh, oh yeah it, say it. I like you too Kim oh. what do you like about him oh jeez oh, where did you get that camera? Only the greatest store on earth. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Mighty features. Get in there, too. Get in here, me amigo. Oh. <laughs> uh, my question is about uh, Haley's boyfriend, Dylan. Mm. <laughs> I just want to do you. Do how, did he how did you come up with that song? Because... <laughs> I was just curious if there are other titles or. Um, I just needed that surprising lyric to get to. It, 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 it had the. It was. It was the. Um, Steve wrote it. You wrote it. You wrote yeah. the lyrics. Yeah. <laughs> you guys know me. I want to reintroduce what my two dads from right Steve. Yeah. Would uh, you like another member of the family to yeah. stand up now? Yeah, yeah. Mom, stand up. For me. Um, <laughs> It was. It needed to be believable. I had to. I had to be both shocking and yet believable that he wasn't so clueless um, that he would sing something that was. Uh, it had to be okay in his mind. I don't know. Um, <laughs> but also, didn't read read the. Read, I mean, wrote, yeah. Read, yeah. Read wrote the uh, uh, the music. Um, uh, read the the actor. Read um, uh, wrote. Um, the music for it, and he did a wonderful job, and he's a really uh, uh, funny actor. Isn't he um, great? We had one of the lyrics, great. my favorite lyric is, um, <laughs> which it was only played in the video, was, uh, underneath a willow tree, <laughs> it's about, he's singing to her, he goes, underneath a willow tree, wearing nothing else but me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm proud of that one. Yeah. <laughs> Baby, baby, I just want to do you. Do you, do you want to do me, do me, underneath the moonlight, the moonlight? <laughs> What's your favorite comedic moment so far, person, scene that you're involved in, that you enjoyed so much and could, you laughed so hard yourself? Uh oh, you I remember? Scared. Julie, Julie and me dancing in the parking lot. Uh, <laughs> We actually had we had choreographers that were worth <laughs> with. For two days For we had choreographers. And, and the dance originally was like so long. so long. Do you remember in the muffin jump and the we had to name jump. all these hard Yeah, so there's moves. like if you heard it, if they had our microphones up during some of this, you would hear us like going, muffin jump, muffin jump, dying swan, dying Really queer run, really queer run. <laughs> yeah. Muffin jump. Muffin jump. We, didn't, muffin jump. we didn't know what we were doing. What was the muffin jump? Oh, because the muffin would come out of the side of your... No, no, no. Oh, the muffin top? <laughs> you know, a muffin jump. Different muffin, baby. <laughs> That's it, Mitchell. 